I'm Jenny. I'm Kelsey. And we're from Omaha Central. Come on! This poem is dedicated to Central's JROTC and to all past, present, and future members of the armed forces. Tears and teeth fall to stone. It catches blood, bullets, and bombs. With open arms, welcoming death like an old friend. Barren feet trim dust clouds as people run blindly. God, too, has turned blind. He does not see their fear. He sees no innocence, innocence or death. He mimics the children who stare wide-eyed but will never know another sunrise. This is when normal men lose hope. These are not normal men. When God does not answer prayers, they do not run away. They breathe. Count to three. Run towards slaughter and away from sanity. Soldiers. His name was Daniel Tyler Lee. He stood six foot five, loved to laugh, an eternal optimist, a husband, father, son, sergeant. sergeant. One. His first tour in Iraq was fought with his brain, with reckless rounds flinging from his fingertips like he had nothing to lose. He loved excitement in the Kentucky soil he was raised on. Two. Two. His second tour was fought with his heart. Filled with fear of what Afghanistan could give him. Car bombs and carnage keeping him from home. His heart was his pride. It stood for his family Thanks. and country. With every beat, he knew he was further from chaos. He was reminded of why he lived. He never got security. On January 14, 2014, a Taliban group issued a surprise attack on Daniel's troop. And with enemy eyes holding a fear of their own, death looked him in the eye and shot him in the chest. Filling his last breath with terror, taking his last heartbeat. He, he was, was 28, 28 years, years old. old. I wonder if Daniel's last thought was that he'll never get to play catch with his son. Or maybe he thought of the tears of his wife when she was told her love was coming home but couldn't tell her goodbye. Maybe it was that his mother would never straighten his tie. His father could never tell him how proud he was. His sister would never laugh at his jokes. His friends were dying with him. I, I wonder, wonder if Daniel, Daniel took a breath and counted to three. Daniel Tyler Lee was one story among thousands like us. One story is almost like the story of those who have walked our home. High school innocence traded for battlefields. Lives lost, lost and changed in Normandy, Korea, Vietnam. Eagles who have seen both world wars. They are a continuing history. Courageous students who have seen the horrors of war. Who have breathed and counted the three. Who have given all they could. Their, their names are put on the list of the lost, but their stories are seldom told. Realize that soldiers are not statistics. They are human beings. When you analyze numbers, imagine names to a picture. Note the light in their eyes. Wonder when the last time they kissed a loved one was. Question whether or not they knew it would be the last time. Every, Every tally mark, mark is a talent. A smile. A dance. That will never be seen again. Pause to think about what is lost at the pull of a trigger. One, two, three.